Good morning, Virgo. Welcome to your reading. Sun, moon, rising, as always, and take the bits that resonate, as always. Okay, this is a general read. It cannot and will not resonate with every person out there. It's not possible. Okay, please don't try and make it fit. If it doesn't resonate, it doesn't resonate. Perhaps a later video next week's probably will resonate. Let's see. a decision in love or about somebody here two very very different people mm. you're seeing somebody is very overbearing the situation is locking up all your energies mm. well it looks like your wish is being granted okay what you've been wait you've been wishing for changes there is there was a situation in the past that you'd be very toxic. You could have been dealing with somebody very, very narcissistic or very addictive to something, you know, very possessive. Mm. There was a lot of selfish actions here and a lot of selfish... reasons for being around you. I feel they were more dependent on you than you were them. There's something new coming in for you, though. There's a fresh approach here, okay? And there's a situation here that, you know, there's been a lot of burdens and responsibilities taken on you. You could even be dealing with a sick parent, caring for them, looking after them, taking on that responsibility. Okay, and now... A new interest comes along. It's mm, finding the courage to act on a decision, to follow a particular route in life through. All right. Yeah. Somebody was very, very possessive, overbearing, controlling in the past. And, you know, you could have even been you could even be married to this person. But on getting your movements are were very, very restricted. You you're doing a lot of reevaluating, that's for sure. There's something new though, it's bringing some kind of peace. Somebody here is sending you messages or will communicate and make you feel very, very good. Okay, but you are making love choices. Like I say, there could be a father figure around you. You could be caring for a parent, but I'm kind of getting somebody's laying the guilt trip on you. But either way, you want to kind of dropped some of the responsibilities you're now realizing that you're carrying somebody else's karma you're carrying somebody else's responsibility you're doing your best to keep the peace okay this could well be with a family issue but mm, i'm kind of getting this decision you there's there's new communication coming in okay but you do feel somebody is kind of not telling you everything they intend. And I'm kind of getting somebody is trying their hardest to keep you around. It's more for their benefit than yours. But mm, I'm kind of getting a communication here, a conversation taking place. Purely on the cerebral level. There's a lot of air energy around you and a lot of water energy around you. Okay, this, this is a choice between two very simple, two, two very different people with two very different attitudes. There's somebody just coming into your life that's much more loving, much more sensitive. Here, you're being very analytical, very judgmental, and I'm kind of getting you will make a very 
unfair indecision. Not for selfish reasons, but you feel you poured enough emotion and this person has drained you emotionally, spiritually and physically and you feel you must make a logical decision on this and you're not letting your feelings get in the way anymore. You've been doing an awful lot of re-evaluating. Okay? There's a new opportunity here presenting itself. You feel you can't miss that opportunity but you are giving it serious thought. Okay? Somebody who has been quiet around you is now revealing their thoughts and feelings to you. And now it's giving you focus. The last ten year, the last ten years or more has been yeah, very very burdensome. And it's just become too much. There's a particular situation here that you are going to take time out from, okay? And I'm kind of getting going forward, you know, after a lot of contemplation, you know, you're going to find the inner strength to make this move. Circumstances or somebody playing on your feelings or your guilt or whatever has been holding you back. But now you've got something to say to somebody and they're not going to like what you hear but you feel you must say this, okay, because you need to spiritually grow. I'm kind of getting, for one of you, there's a particular situation where you're caring for somebody, perhaps a family member or whatever, you know, and you, now you, you're reducing the time spent with them, you're taking a step back. There's somebody here from your past who you couldn't get, you couldn't see eye to eye with. And now going forward, because it was a very controlled situation and there was a part in other ways, it gave you both time to think and now there's a coming back together and it's kind of evened out. But I feel for some of you there is a there is a there is a particular job here. New career move for some of you. But as I say, if you're caring for somebody, a family member or whatever, it could even be a career as carer. You know, for a lot of people. But I feel there's a lot of pent up anger and frustration. And, you know, you've got some things to say to people, two people in particular, and, you know, this is a decision for you. You you need to make lifestyle changes. You need to pass some of these burdens that's on you now onto somebody else and at least share the load. Thanks very much for watching. Bye-bye now. Bye-bye for now, sorry. <laughs>